it kind of goes back to the ability to have uh, the ability to execute in the sh short term and plan simultaneously. Uh, I've, I, I, I've done it in multiple ways. Uh, in an ideal world, you want to get to continuous planning. The planning is happening continuously, iteratively, so that it's not even uh, any churn on the organization. But that's not the case typically because context switches, there are different directions maybe you have to take from board. For that purpose, I think what we do is essentially uh, focus on the data in terms of what, again, I think going back to, you take those pillars, you put KPIs over there, you put input level KPIs that move that, you take a stock of where your KPIs are, where they need to be as it lines up to a board budget or a future budget. And then what every team is essentially doing from a bottoms up innovation standpoint is essentially carving out, okay, this, these are the priorities that I can work on. These are the big uh, pillar, these are the big force multipliers that we can deliver over a longer period of time. And then I think it becomes a question of investment allocation, right? Because you want your investment to point in the direction where there's maximum leverage. If you've been able to do that, the big boulders are already set and the conversations you are having are on the pebbles. Right, like should we do X or Y? And that is a much more contained conversation to have at an executive level across your stakeholders. Uh, and there's a lot more durable, durability and predictability of the plans. But to get there is an adventure. <laughs> <It's>, right, <laughs> totally, totally.